Hey everybody, this is Steve Housen with TonsOfTech.com. Uh, today we're going to do a quick review of the LG Optimus V. This is the virgin mobile version of the uh, the LG Optimus. Before this, the only f Android phone available on uh, virgin mobile was the Samsung Intercept, and uh, you know, love it or hate it, it uh, it wasn't that great of a phone. Personally, I didn't like it, but you know, some people love it, so everybody has their own taste. This phone actually is um, a very nice phone. It's $150 off contract. Um, so let's go ahead and start looking at some of the hardware on this. Um, at the bottom, you have the standard uh, menu, home, back, and search buttons. Uh, you know what, let me stop and first apologize for the horrible screen protector job I did on this thing. It's a uh, yeah, it's a standard, you know, one of those generic screen protectors that I hacked down to size. So, uh, I apologize for that. It's ugly, and uh, just so you know, that's not the phone. That's just my bad installation job. So, uh, there's the buttons at the bottom. They're hard buttons. They light up, and they are raised a little bit. Some people like the soft buttons. Some people like the hard buttons. You know, it's all a matter of preference. They they work great, though. No problems. Um, on the side is a dedicated camera and voice search button as well as the volume up and down um, on this side there's not much except for a micro SD card slot same thing we've seen a million times um, at the top is a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack power button and on the back is a speaker and 3.2 megapixel camera that actually takes really um, well pretty nice pictures you know I, I I think the quality is actually quite good. The video, eh, the video is okay. It's, you know, a million times better than the intercept video, but uh, it's still, it's still good. I mean, for a hundred fifty dollar phone, it's great. I got, I got to say that. So let's go ahead and fire it up. It's got uh, Android two point two Froyo on here, and uh, right now I have Launcher Pro, and as you can see, it is not laggy at all. I have this spin animation. On Launcher Pro, there's no lag. I mean, this thing is super smooth. Opening up the app drawer, yeah, or Facebook. So opening up the app drawer, you know, that's that's great. Super smooth. I hardly ever get any lag on this phone, and it's my day to day phone now. Um, in Maps, you have the the full maps with the you know the the spinning and the Rotate, you know, tilting, and the uh, 3D buildings. That's all there, you know, standard. Um, let's go into the browser here, and there's my tons of tech site. I apologize for, you know, some of this is hard to see. The phone or the camera is auto focusing, so um, it's kind of tough. It's got swipe on it, which I'm still not so good at here. Let's go to Google. Uh, just so you can see the loading speed here. I'm on Wi-Fi. Got a pretty decent connection, and uh, you know it's pretty fast. It's of course you can go landscape, and it switches over nice and quick, nice and snappy. Um, it's really not too much to show you. I'm not going to show you Angry Birds and you know all the typical stuff. Angry Birds runs great on here, as do most games. Um, let's see, I got Squibble on here. Okay, I'll show you Squibble. This is actually a kind of a cool little game here. Match bit. Yeah, yeah. Let's just do JJJ. There, that's my new name, JJJ. Easy. I'm all scared. Okay. Alright, let's skip that. Alright, so here we are. Squiggles loaded up, so let's uh let's get going here. Yeah, it's nice and smooth. Works uh works great. I have used the uh, stuff like um you know the Sims on here, Sims work great. This is actually a really fun game if you don't have this one. Alright, I'm not gonna play this whole squibble game. Just that gives you an idea of what games are like on there. I guess that's uh, all I'm going to show you on here. Um, actually, I can show you the camera. Like I said, this is going to be a quick.
quick and dirty review here. So here's the camera video. It's your standard 2.2 camera. Got all your your settings and I mean $150 phone and look at how snappy this thing is right out of the box. So you can take the picture with the the camera button or use the little on-screen thing. And uh, you know you got your typical gallery and all your 2.2 apps. And the cheapest plan on uh, Virgin Mobile is $25 for unlimited data, unlimited text, and 300 minutes. Um, and that's $25 a month with a $150 phone. Personally, I think you can't beat it. Um, for those of you that don't use that that many minutes, I would definitely recommend this phone and the plan. Uh, it uses the Sprint network for pretty decent service. Uh, we've not had a problem with it, and uh, yeah. Before this phone came out, there's no way I would have recommended the Samsung Fascinate or Intercept. But uh, with this phone, the LG Optimus V, I, I can definitely recommend this. If you want to see anything specific or have any uh, questions on the phone, just leave comments below or uh, you know send a message or leave a comment on the website, tonsatech.com. Thanks a lot.